Royal Romain, Roman of the King, the ultimate font for the King of all Kings. In 1692, the Sun King Louis XIV ordered that a typeface be designed at any necessary expense for the exclusive use of the Royal Print Office. This request was to establish a new style for his reign that would convey his authority. Development for the font took several years, along with the entire committee of the Academy of Sciences. These scientists examined the font Garamond to understand and determine how the most celebrated characters had been constructed. Their goal was not to simply reproduce or reinterpret the font, but to scientifically perfect it through analytical and mathematical practices to create a new style of letter. The characteristics of geometric design is the perfect example of France embodying the new wave of thought in the age of reason. After years of development, this man started to cut the final punches of the Royal Romain font and finished his part of the work, with the font's first appearance being later that year in this book in 1702. The complete set of 21 sizes of Roman and Italic letters was later finished by his successor, along with additional help, 43 years later in 1745. It has been argued that even though the font struck the people's eyes at the time as being cold, the font would have been successful even without the endorsement of the king. According to legend, King Louis XIV was so enraged by the King of Sweden's request to obtain a set of punches of Royal Romain that all important French designers in the royal print house had to be able to closely imitate the letters to prevent the king's royal displeasure. Also, because Royal Romain was the exclusive font of official documents for the French government, any use of it outside the royal print office and any similarity to forgery or imitation would lead to immediate execution. With Royal Romain's allegiance to the grid and increased emphasis on verticality and contrast between thick and thin elements, Royal Romain influenced the typefaces of Foreigner and Baskerville. The French typographer Maximilian Vox saw this typeface as the origin of the transitional family. Royal Romain has been redesigned into a digital typeface in 2004 by Gert Weischer, who expanded on the font by adding in a bunch of new weights. Today, Royal Romain can be bought on the internet, which includes over 440 glyphs. Now, the font can be used in many more countries, can be enjoyed in much better kerning, and a lot of ligatures.